What's going on, y'all? Welcome back to the garage and welcome to Show and Tell Saturday. <laughs> Why not? We'll just make that up as we go along. Let's let's adjust this camera just a second. Just a second. All right, I think that'll work. So I thought tonight we do a show and tell, you know, subject and. I said, why not? Let's look at some premium Aston Martins. What you see before you is the Aston Martin Vulcan. Uh, this is one of those things I found at the uh, Best Buy that they sold it to me for the same price as a basic. So heck yeah. Even if I was just going to steal the wheels off of it, which was my intent, uh, the b price of a basic, a buck 25, whatever they're charging at big lots. Uh, yeah. I took it, but then it grew on me. So now it's in the collection. <laughs> you can see the carbon fiber accents on the top there, which is freaking cool, man. It is not a bad looking car. And this color is just, it's such a weird color. It's not, it's not really orange. It's not really rose gold. I don't know what you call it. Just like blood, blood orange maybe. I don't know. It's freaking fantastic. So I said, why not? Let's go ahead and take a look at a couple other premiums that we got. Um, this is the Aston Martin Valhalla concept from the James Bond Live and Let Die or No Time to Die. Sorry, Live and Let Die. That's my favorite movie. <laughs> yeah, Live and Let Die. That's my favorite movie with the Paul McCartney theme song. Freaking love that movie. I watch it every time I see it on... So here we have the Aston Martin Valhalla concept, which is really an interesting story. There is an entire documentary on YouTube on how they got to use this for the James Bond film because this car was not in existence and they built seven, seven just for the movie. <laughs> yeah, so some of the ones that were driving were just shells, basically. But uh, you can kind of see the nice contrast here. And I do have our Hot Wheels basic version of it. Uh, y'all, if you weren't really paying attention, they are very, very close. I think Hot Wheels gave us a very great car that rolls off the side. <laughs> uh, color is a little bit different. Uh, we got a, a very silver basic and a darker, almost pewter silver on the, on the, uh, premium. Of course, the tops are different. But both very very nice cars so happy to have it. and I have done a ton of customs on the basics don't have one to show you because I think I pretty much sent them all off <laughs> that's just me because it has a nice color break to it it has a very nice color break to it anyway so we've got that uh, Valhalla concept and then we have this one that was just sent to us from uh, the diecast car nut himself so I thought that would be pretty awesome this one is from the Exotic Envy set, which has my favorite Lamborghini in that lime green metallic, which is a trophy. It stays on the wall, but he was kind enough to send me two of this one. So I said, why not? Let's just go ahead and open this one up too and check it out. Yeah, the Valhalla concept. Very, very cool car. Very James Bond kind of, you know, it's something he would drive high-end exotic, you know, hand coach built, uh, just fantastic. Doesn't beat a DB5 though. The DB5 will always be, it always have a place in my heart, man. I love that little silver car that he drove and uh, the living daylights and man, all kinds of movies. But yep, so these are the three of my, oh, no, oh, see that fooled me right there. <laughs> Almost grabbed it, I think it was a premium. But these are the three premium uh, Aston Martins that I have in my collection. I have a bunch of basic ones, uh, including this one and the uh, Vantage, which is an actual race car that they are racing right now against C8Rs. And the C8Rs are slightly faster than the Aston Martin Vantage, so don't tell nobody. <laughs> anyway, y'all, that's my big video for the night. Uh, show and tell Saturday, the Aston Martin edition. So pretty happy with these to be in the collection so yeah it's something i like just wanted to show and tell on saturday with y'all my friends <laughs> so anyway y'all thanks for stopping by the garage y'all be safe be well and be kind 
always be kind. Till the next time at the garage, I'll see you later, grease monkeys.